Yo, what's going on guys? Torch Doom here and yep, this is the return of Try Hard Tuesday. I know it's been weeks and weeks of not uploading this and uh fortunately we finally got a what is this called? Uh gameplay for you guys for Try Hard Tuesday. He's rocking out the MSMC um cyborg camo I believe. Yeah, this camo came out a while ago and it looks really nice. It's like freaking magma on the gun and I'm sorry if the gameplay is laggy on your screen because um I was actually recording this from uh what is this, Fusion's point of view like not Fusion's point of view he was host while doing this because he didn't save it to his edited films and only he could see it in his personal films so I had to record from his point of view and it's kind of laggy like like here and stuff I'm sorry for that hopefully you guys can forgive me but I don't remember what the final score is I think it's like an 80 kill game 70 kill game. It's not 100 plus. I just had to do this. I just had to post this because, um, as I said, we haven't post try hard to post the try hard Tuesday in weeks, and I really wanted to apologize for that. If you guys really like the series and didn't see it, I mean, no one really complained about it in the comment section, so I guess you guys didn't really care. But yep, it's back this week, and this is by Torch Fusion, as you probably already noticed by now. Um, he's in the kill feed and everything, but. Torch Fusion is our red gun gameplay getter person, I guess, because uh, normally the rest of the Torch Clan are sniping or trick shotting, feeding or something, and then uh, Fusion runs out with his uh, tryhard guns and gets the gameplay for us. So hopefully you guys enjoy that in the background. And a few note, a few things to note about this gameplay is that there, I think there's like one or two people trick shotting, like right there. That guy is trick shotting mid game trying to get something, and uh, he gets a lot of kills off of him. Uh, it's not he's not setting up or anything. He's just going for trick shots, I guess, mid game, which I wouldn't really um, advise because it's not the smartest thing to do. But I mean, if you want to do it, go ahead. I'm not gonna like make you not or anything, but I'm just saying it's not the smartest idea. But yeah, so I don't really have a topic for this episode, but. As you guys already probably, I'm making this, um, what is this, commentary early. I'm actually making this commentary on Thursday, and I'm uploading this on Tuesday for Try Hard Tuesday. So, by now, you guys should have seen our, um, mini Taj made by Terrence B. He has a channel with, like, 360 subs or something, so make sure to go check him out. Really good editor. He's, ma he's gonna make some player episodes for us, too, in the near future. So hopefully you guys can go over to his channel, drop him a sub, and I'm pretty sure you guys will not be upset by his content. And um, yeah, so that's a quick note about that. And you also should have seen that montage that I posted a week ago or something. The one where Torch Raz edited it, and he's our newest editor. And uh, he already made a Torch account. He also doesn't have Black Ops 2, so I unfortunately cannot record with him, like Black Ops 2, Roto Kill Cam or something. But he does have Modern for 3 and the uh, older CODs, so um, we can record Road to Kill Cam with him. We're still trying to record uh, Road to Kill Cam on Modern for 3 with him. I don't know if you guys already saw that. If you did, I'm sorry, but we're trying trying our hardest to do a Modern for 3 Road to Kill Cam. It's obviously really hard because I've never trick shot in Modern for 3. Most of our players haven't trick shot in Modern for 3. And I think in Modern for 3, there are a lot less trick shots to go for. Like, it's only like. I don't even know the trick shots, like a reload cancel, um, a weapon swap, I don't even know, like there's very little trick shots to go for, and silent shotting, stuff like that, so hopefully we get an episode out there really fast, and also a lot of our other players are working on their episodes, like Torch Twister is really close to finishing his episode, there's also Torch Fizz that needs a few more, Torch Pigeon and everyone, so also a really quick note about uh, Torch Fusion, Torch Fusion actually sold his um copy of black ops 2 and he's gonna sell his ps3 soon so i don't know if he's gonna stay in the clan or not until he, unless he gets ghost i don't see wh how he would stay but unfortunately he sold his stuff he doesn't really like the game i don't blame him but he's also gonna sell his ps3 so i don't know if he's still in the clan or not we have to wait for that so that's unfortunate we lost a really good uh red gun player i guess and um yeah, I guess we're just going to have to deal with that. So, also, um, we're, we might be doing an RC challenge soon because a lot of people asked to join the clan. And I've always told them add me on PS3 and stuff, but a lot of them add me and then they don't have the clips for it. So, 
it's kind of a waste of time but uh, make sure you add me and the rules are five clips just give me five good clips for feeds they can't be demolition they can't be set up they can't be um what is it that you can't be like camping a spawn like sitting in a corner waiting for them to spawn or anything and for trick shots they just have to be online they have to be complex not complex my bad but <laughs> they have to be complex they can't be like a freaking what is it like a shock charge cancer or something because those are those are pretty easy to go like to get and i don't really want those like all of our members can do that so i need something different from you and just give me five of those they have to be good, they have to be online, and um, yeah, no setting up, because setting up is stupid, and that doesn't count, so yeah, hopefully now on, people will understand the rules for joining the clan and not ask me all the time, but uh, yeah, so as you can tell, this guy's inviting me to join the clan, and if you're watching this video, make sure to go back, if you skipped over what I just said, make sure to go back and listen to what I said, so you know how to join the clan. Um... What else is there? So, uh, his I forgot to go over this. His kill his kill streaks are UAV, Stealth Chopper, Orbital V set, and um, he's using the MSMC as you can tell. He has a concussion. I think he had two concussions. I'm not sure, but he also has a grenade. And uh, yeah, he goes in. He goes. Um, I don't know. I don't know his final score, but he he does get a nuclear. He gets a few unstoppables and then dies. I think he goes absolutely in this game. He also, um, they also win the game, obviously, because they're double capping, and he has V-sets and style choppers up in the air. So, um, even though he was slaying, he still help, helped out the team, because, um, yeah, by keeping them off the flag, keeping them constantly on the map, so everyone on the team can see him and stuff. So, uh, yeah, right there, he's on his brutal. I didn't, he didn't even tell me that he got the nuclear, like, he just said he had good gameplay. So, I went to record it, and then while the recording was happening, I was surprised he got the nuclear, because... I mean, if I got a nuclear, I would make sure to tell someone that I got a nuclear. So, um, and, uh, again, I am really sorry for the lag. I probably won't do this kind of stuff in the future. Hopefully, I get to record in my perspective. It's just that this is such an old gameplay, and he had it in his personal films instead of his edited films. So, that's why I had no other option that I could do. So, uh, yeah, I don't think it's that bad. I mean, there is a little bit of lag. But it's not that bad. So also one quick topic is that uh, about Call of Duty Ghost, people have been messaging me saying, "What are you gonna do? Um, Ghost doesn't have quick scoping or trick shotting or anything. Is your clan gonna fall apart? Are you gonna go back to older cards? All that stuff." So um, a quick answer to that is we aren't sure if what is it if Ghost has uh, quick scoping or um, trick shotting or anything yet. So I'm not sure. But rumors are that they don't have quick scoping, but they can't get rid of quick scoping because it's like impossible to get rid of quick scoping. They could make it harder, which is what I think they did, and people just misinterpreted that. But right here, he gets a lot of unstoppables, and then he unfortunately dies because he has his ballistic knife out. Ballistic knife out, and uh, I would have personally ran away from the situation right here, but he tried to go balls deep, and I guess it didn't work out for him. But, uh, yeah, I, I get easily distracted. Right there, three people on him, he gets EMP grenaded. I think he got one person, I'm not even sure, because he was EMP grenaded. But, yeah, so, as I was saying, we don't know about Ghost yet, so we'll wait and see, and then I'll make an update video or something. But, um, yeah, so, I'm actually really excited for Ghost. I pre I'm going to pre-order I'm slacking. I'm going to eventually forget to pre-order, not get Sky... What is that, Free Fall, I believe? Yeah, Free Fall, and then, yeah, I'm just going to be really angry at myself. So hopefully I do remember, and um, yeah, and hopefully you guys enjoyed this gameplay, because um, I don't, I think this is six v six, and he's playing domination. Unfortunately, it is Nuketown. I'm sorry, we had to rush this episode out there. That's why. Sorry, it's Nuketown, but we did change it up. It's not demolition, and it's normal ten minutes, I believe, maybe a little bit less or a little bit more. And um, yeah, so the gameplay is coming to an end. I think he gets 80 kills, he got a few nuclear, I mean, not a few nuclears, a few unstoppables, and it's overall a good game, right here he goes, he gets a triple, I believe, yup, he got a triple right there, he got a few triples in this game, actually, so this is Torch Fusion's gameplay, my commentary, peace out, YouTube.